It's 2 a.m. and I can't fall asleep Cause I'm not tired I'm thinking about the days we used to shine When we were young I told you that we should start a band And reach for the sky It's 2 a.m. and I can't fall asleep I'm just not tired I can hear the raindrops falling It's cold outside And I kind of feel like calling But it's soon Good morning friends, welcome back. It is Thursday morning, um, quarter after eight. I've actually been up for a little while. I had some trouble sleeping last night and so I've been awake for a bit. Um, I woke up, tried to go back to sleep, realized it wasn't going to happen so I thought, well, I might as well get up. So I just fixed myself some breakfast because I'm actually hungry. I'm normally not a breakfast person. Uh, at least not this early. Typically I don't eat my first meal until like more of a normal like lunch time. But uh, I was feeling a little hungry this morning. And so I've got three eggs and four sauce, turkey sausage link or chicken sausage links. The eggs are farm fresh eggs from my friend Lindsay. So thank you Lindsay. She has been gifting us eggs from their chickens and it's been great to have fresh ones. They just taste so much better than store-bought. So I'm going to sit down with some breakfast and I am actually watching Hulu. Uh, just catching up. Oh, I have toast. Just catching up on um, This Is Us. I think I have one episode left after this. I haven't watched it in a while. So I've been spending the last few days catching up on things on Hulu because um, it's been so hot outside the past few days again that we've not done anything outside and it's just been um, inside quiet activities. So Alice might be having her friend over today, um, actually Lindsay's daughter, Liliana, might be coming over today. I texted her, her mom late last night, and, well, last night and didn't hear back from her because she was putting her um, oldest son to bed. And so I expect to hear back from her sometime this morning, probably once she is up and moving around and realizes that it's an okay time to text. Kids are still sleeping. Will is at work. Alice is actually in my bed. She came in around 4.30, I want to say, um, after Will had left for work, and so she's cuddled up in my bed right now. But it's supposed to be mid-90s-ish today. Um, if Liliana comes over and it's the weather is okay. I might take the kids to splash pad just to get them out and doing something fun because we haven't really been out of the house the last few days. I also have some errands to run today. I do need to go to the post office to check the P.O. box and I'm actually going to be closing the, P the P.O. box. The price of the P.O. box has gone up quite a bit um, the last few times I've had to renew it so I think I'm going to close it just because it's just not worth the cost right now. Um, so post office and then car wash and library. And I have to stop at Kroger to pick up a few things. They've, they've got some good weekly digital deals this week. Half gallons of milk are 99 cents. Um, grapes are 99 cents a pound. And melons, like personal watermelons, honeydew, and cantaloupe are all $1.79, I believe. So I figured I would run in there and pick some of that stuff up to help with grocery costs because milk uh, with it being 99 cents for a half gallon that's basically two dollars for a gallon and Walmart right now um, milk is over three dollars a gallon for the great value brand so figured save a little bit of money and I'll be out and about anyway gas prices are okay right now I drove past Speedway the other day coming or last night coming home from a small group and it was four 63 I think at Speedway which means Costco is probably a little bit cheaper than that so um, in our area they're at least starting to trend back down a little bit Michigan when we were up there they hit 519 during the week we were there it has not hit that high around my area um, I need to butter my toast because I just remembered that, that popped up and now my butter is probably not going to melt very well but I will get back with you in a little bit I'm gonna go eat some breakfast and watch the last of This Is Us and just let the morning, um, I was going to say wake me up. I'm sleepy, so we'll see. Um, yeah. 
All right, friends, I am here again. It's 12.30, I am making some pizza rolls for the kids. Um, so I ate breakfast this morning. I napped for, I mainly watched This Is Us and then I napped for like a half hour or so. And then the kids got up um, because, remember how I said, I think my friend Lindsay was waiting until a little bit later to text me back about having Leanne over. Oh, that's a lot. Uh, so I had texted her because I made those eggs this morning and she told me to do the water test with farm fresh eggs that way you can tell if there's a bad one you put them in a bowl of water and if they sink they're good and if they float they're bad so don't eat it and I texted her I was like I had my first floater this morning and I felt really bad having to throw it away but like she said better than eating a spoiled egg so give me a second so, where was I going with this? Um, what? You're Gatorade? Making a cyclone with this Gatorade. So, Wynn picked up Liliana, basically is what I was getting at. So Alice and I left here. We went and got gas at Costco, which is down to $4.55 a gallon. We got Starbucks, we tried, Alice tried their new Paradise drink which is pineapple passion fruit with coconut milk. And it's very pineapple. And it's got chunks of pineapple and a freeze dried pineapple. Ooh, lack of sleep has me yawning like crazy despite the fact I tried their newer chocolate cold foam or chocolate cold brew, cold foam, chocolate. yeah, anyway, that was pretty good. So we did Costco, we did Starbucks. We stopped at the car wash and then we went to the library and I picked up a book um, where is the book I picked up? It's called M is for Mama. Um, it's a newer one. I had seen it all over like Instagram and stuff. Yeah, M is for Mama. A Rebellion Against Mediocre Motherhood by Abby Halberstadt, Stat, Bible-believing mother of 10. So I picked that up and at that point, Lindsay had texted me and we were meeting at Kroger. Cause that's kind of like the halfway point between our houses. And so I met her there and picked Liliana up. Then Alice and Lily, and then, <laughs> there's a lot going through my head. I'm trying to like, my brain is, or my, my brain is going faster than my mouth, or my mouth's going faster, anyway. Will was finishing up work and he was at that store, so he came over and said hi, and then he drove off and went to his next store. And then Alice and Liliana and I went into Kroger and got a few things. Are your girls coming in? Wow, you guys were out for like five minutes. I know it is, I told you that. Do you guys want to go to the uh, splash pad? I got my bathing suit. I know you did. And you brought Alice's bathing suit. Um, let's eat some lunch and I'll, and then maybe we can go do that. Okay? So these are going to be about, don't, not what I wanted to do. Um, I might take them to splash pad, is what you're hearing. We ran into Kroger and picked up the deals that were there grapes and watermelons and milk and then from there I was waiting for my Walmart order to get delivered it was scheduled for between 12 and 1 <clears throat> and I got home at like 12.07 and it was already at my front door and I hadn't gotten an alert or anything saying that it was being delivered and as of right now at 12.38 it still shows that they're process or preparing the order <sighs> So that was frustrating. So I had to call. So Jackson helped me and the girls helped me bring everything in. So we got all that. I recorded the haul, got all the groceries put away, and now I'm just making them some pizza rolls. Cheese it has popped corn. Oh, the ad changed. Oh, come back. It's a Walmart ad. Hmm. What are you girls doing? Crafting? Okay. Uh, so that's where we're at. It's hot out. The girls were gonna play outside. They're out there for like 10 minutes. Um, and like I said, I might take them to the splash pad. I need to just, I've been running, running like go, go, go since Alice and I left the house. And I'm just trying to like catch up, literally catch my breath. Girl, if 
fields were mine. We played hide and seek for hours, raised our shadows among the pines. So offshore, playful and free, without a care in the world. I was one rich little girl. All right, friends, we are home from the splash pad slash park. Stopped at Meyer on the way home. Yes, I know, we've already been to Kroger and we had a Walmart delivery. I figured let's round it out with the trio and stop in at Meyer. Um, we decided we were gonna have hot dogs for dinner and the ones I have are currently frozen. So um, hot dogs and some buns is all we needed. And the kids played not very long at the splash pad. They played at the park for longer. So I think they, look at that pimple. Will's looking at me. Stop copying you. Um, focus. Yeah. Just put it uh, over the bathtub, like the edge of the bathtub. I'll wash them later with towels. I just don't want them on the carpet. Uh, they played at the splash pad for maybe a half hour and then an hour and a half at the playground. And as we were leaving, there was an Italian ice truck there. So I got them each an Italian ice, which is more like Sherbert. Like when I think anything with the name ice in it, I think more, I was thinking it was more like snow cones, but it was not. It was the same place that was at the McConnell Springs, the Founders Day event. Remember I told you about that, I think. I was like, it said Italian ice, but it was definitely Sherbert. I mean, you're lucky it wasn't just spaghetti with ice in it. <laughs> wow. It's funny. Did you hear that? Spaghetti with ice in it. So um, Alice got cherry, Liliana got strawberry, and Jackson got orange creamsicle. So they ate those on our way from the park to Meyer. Went into my air, grabbed the hot dogs and buns, and now we are home. It is 4.52. Um, we are just chilling. Uh, I changed out of my sweaty girls' clothes. The kids changed out of their wet bathing, well, they weren't wet anymore, but their bathing suits. I will do dinner in a little bit. I don't think they're hungry yet. I think I'm just gonna do the hot dogs and watermelon and then make a cucumber tomato salad, just something quick and easy. And I do the hot dogs in the air fryer, 400 minutes. 400 minutes. Nope. Incorrect. 400 degrees for four minutes, four to five minutes, depending on how. Alice claims that she bit her tongue and it's bleeding. Do you believe her? No. <laughs> Why else would her mouth be red? Because of her stuff that she ate. Yeah. Is your mouth orange? I spat in it. I spat. Ah. Yeah, the red ones are definitely leave more. No kidding. Are you ready for dinner yet? I'm ready for a hot pocket. That's not what we're having for dinner. Man, that has like gotten yes. redder. What? Anyway, um, that's what? what's happening. Oh, were you guys teasing him? Oh, I have to show you guys. I got our newest, oh man, nut stop order in. I have to unpack it real quick and I'll show you that. We got a Cali and a Lily Alley. I mean a Liliana. Isn't she sweet? The hamster, not the girl. Just kidding, the girl's sweet too. Do you have fun at Splash Red? Yeah. She's still got that yogurt mouth in there. You can see it right there. <laughs> she got chubby cheek. She's like, please let me go hide my food. I'm let you hide it for three minutes. What are you doing? Her sensor. Do not put her in front of an iPad. She likes it. I realize she's just gonna use your iPad as a ramp and crawl right out of there. Cause she is a little daredevil. Now it's gonna fall out of her. Aren't you, right? Callie, what are they doing to you, girl? What are they doing to you? All right, so we got a nut stop order. Um, Nutstop.com, use code SIMPLEWIFE, Simple Life for 10% off your first order. Uh, there's a link down below and the discount code. So it does, there's a lot of it that is chocolate coated stuff and it comes with ice packs and it was fine other than the miniature peanut butter cups is now one big ooey gooey peanut butter mess, but okay that's okay no cherries for you babe what they said they were out of stock i oh, know but they used to they got an email saying that I'd, they were that things were in the stock i don't think they meant those things okay so we've got gummy worms gummy bears salted cashews um i got two different granolas to go with my yogurt parfaits so there's the breakfast blend and the chocolate banana blend chocolate covered pretzels 
limoncello almonds, Neapolitan pretzels. Those look a little melty too. Not too bad though. Not like the peanut butter cups. Uh, the little non perial rainbow non perial mini drops. Those are great for throwing in stuff. I don't know. Chocolate covered peanuts, yogurt covered peanuts, uh, chocolate chips, and yogurt covered pretzels. So we love our goodies. Will's favorite is the chocolate covered cherries, which as it turns out, they're disgusting. You guys need to quit ordering them. That way they can be in stock when I go to order them. Yes, because they've been out of stock the last few so times. So just, just trust me, you guys don't want them. Just leave me some. <laughs> Was that convincing, y'all? Was that convincing? So anyway, we love not stop. We've been getting them for quite a few years, uh, but I'm gonna put this stuff away. I don't know where, but I think I'm probably just gonna put it back in this box. That peanut butter is going to, yeah, eat it. That's where they're all going. All right, what's happening over here? We made wounds. Oh, speak nice and loud. We made wounds <laughs> out of makeup. They were in the bathroom using makeup to make wounds. Oh, gross, your skin's peeling off. Oh, that looks bloody. This is what girls do these days. <laughs> Will is upstairs cutting Jackson's hair, and then I need to cut his hair. He's gonna come, or no, I cut his hair. I cut his hair. Um, I just made a cucumber, tomato, and onion salad. I used my veggie chopper. There's a link to this down in the description box. That's the lid for it, but um, I did this size for the cucumbers and tomatoes. And then I did this size for just one small onion and the onions. So this morning I had eggs from Lindsay's chickens. These are onions from um, her father-in-law's garden. So I just did one onion in there. And I'm going to, I meant to do, I wanted to do two cucumbers, but this one froze in the back of the fridge. So it's not good. Like that end is completely frozen. So I only have one English cucumber in there and then some grape tomatoes and one small onion. That onion is very potent though. I'm also gonna cut up at least one watermelon, and add a little salt and pepper to this and just stir it and put it in the fridge. And that'll be side dishes, the veggies and the fruit to go with the hot dogs. Alrighty, dinner time. It's a monkey tattoo for so Jackson. Haunted. We've You're got, haunted. show them what we got, sis. Tell them what we got for dinner. No, eh, <laughs> dinner, show them what we got. Um, so we got some. Start over here, point. Grapes. Grapes. Strawberries. Strawberries. Melon. Watermelon. Mustard. Mustard for hot Bowls. dogs. <laughs> okay. Relish. Tomato salad. Pickles. Hot dogs. <laughs> Watermelon. And then this is leftovers. Will's actually going to eat off of this. There's a little bit of goulash. And then this is burrito filling. I might have some of this with a few tortilla chips, actually. Um, and then bunches of fruits. Fruits and some salad stuff. We don't see this fella much on camera anymore. He just took some nasal spray because he was having some sniffles, and so was I. I had to take nasal spray too, like the kind, like the medicated kind, like Efren, that actually helps you breathe, breathe. Um, Will cut his hair, cleaned it up today, looking very spiffy. Do you like it? Yeah. So we cleaned the sides up, and then he took just a trim off of the length, and then I did Will's. I accidentally trimmed off a little too much in a certain spot or two. I mean, I'm sorry. So we trim his up like every four to six weeks. This one was a little bit longer because yeah. we were supposed to do it the week we went to Michigan and we didn't. And then we've been back from Michigan for a few weeks and we just did it. But this guy's heading to bed. It's like sticking like Velcro. Yeah. It's very. Yeah, not tired. I know. It's 10.23 and you have to be up at 3. 3, that's no fun at all. I'm just cleaning up the kitchen. We went through almost one of the seedless watermelons I got at Kroger today. They're on sale for $1.79. This is what we have left from that. Um, put these strawberries away and I can mix those up for you tomorrow with some fruit dip. Sounds good. Oh, yeah, that's my hair tie. Um... Yeah, so he's going to bed. The girls are upstairs playing. 
I am cleaning the kitchen. I have to take out my contacts because they're dry. I napped a little bit. The girls and Jackson, they all went back outside for a bit. They've got, they got four hours outside total today between the park and then playing outside after we got home. They were outside until like 9.30. Um, and they didn't want to come in, but it was dark at that point. I was like, no, you need to come in because we live in like a townhouse neighborhood and I just feel more comfortable having them come in where I could see them. So the girls are upstairs playing with their dolls and stuff right now. I think Alice just came down for a blanket. She said they're building a blanket for it, so we'll see how that turns out. And I have one episode, or I'm on the last episode of This Is Us, so I need to finish that from this morning. Um, well, the kids are outside. I took a little bit of a nap because I was super tired. Like I said I didn't sleep well last night, and I woke up shortly after going to sleep because of um, cramps and stuff in my belly so anyway i am going to close this out thanks for coming along on another day in the life housewife life homeschool life all of that we're currently inadvertently taking somewhat of a summer break um i hadn't planned on it but we've just been doing so many activities and stuff out of the house that there hasn't been much time for like summer schooling the kids did, did did do math twice this week so there's that Didn't, did you do math this morning or was that yesterday i think it was yesterday yeah, so they did math twice this week, but tomorrow's Friday. We have a day of baking. Um, the girls are going to help me bake three different types of cookies. We're going to make banana snickerdoodles, apple snickerdoodles, and orange creamsicle co um, cookies for a homeschool family dance that we're going to on Saturday. So I'm going to get all the baking done tomorrow. Um, I ordered these. So I had one of these. Well, technically I have two, but one of them is in use holding some craft supplies of these Rubbermaid containers. These take longs are perfect for cookies. Um, so I ordered another two pack from Walmart and it got delivered today. So that way I have one for each of the types of cookies that we're taking. Um, so yeah, that should be fun. So the girls will help me bake tomorrow. Jackson might help too. He likes to help with that. And yeah, what's up? Your yes. shirt is so dirty. Do you want to close this out? Sure. Thank you for watching this video. Make sure to subscribe. Click that red button right down there. Bye. Love you.